When you are young and full of hope, living the American dream, it can make you feel invincible. Nothing can stop you or stand in your way until the unexpected happens. The unexpected happened to me the day I was diagnosed with a rare form of drug-resistant tuberculosis. This disease was so contagious that I was placed in a quarantine and given two weeks to live. So much for being invincible. Hi Scorpios, welcome to my channel, we're doing your reading. Welcome, sit down. Is your weeklies. You had an amazing dailies, if I'm not mistaken. So check it out, okay? Make sure you're watching the, the uh, that one and the other one. Oh, wait, all my readings <laughs> for the Scorpio. Yes, I'm being sarcastic. Okay. Yeah, that is no shade right there. That is totally... <laughs> Make sure you are liking and supporting your own reads. I doubt with the Scorpio though, that they won't. Okay, it's their time to shine. Okay, I'll tell you when it's time to hide. Okay, because a lot of people are looking for you. Should we do? Shall we? Oracle card first. Okay. I'm not going to drink the coffee. It's a little old since this morning. Okay, so I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm I'm five of pentacles with that one right now. I'm ghosting that coffee. <laughs> oh. So let's see what's going on with my Scorpio. Okay. I asked this on Instagram before. If you are a, um, let's just say for this week, um, what uh, what uh, what what tarot card would you be? So put in the comments. Okay. I won't read it though, but go to go into comments in Instagram. Okay. There's more chances there if I'm there. Okay. So make sure you follow me on Instagram also. Here we go. Let's see here. I feel like a lot of opportunities opening up for you. I'm not sure with what. I feel like it's more of a career. There, um, there are certain people that you need to block, which is very common. Um, you know, it's like for readers to say. Um, but this person that you have to block, I feel like they're, um, they're stagnant and they don't want to make a move. Okay, but I better feel like it's more of a career business kind of thing. Okay, so it's like move over, you know, it's like you're not doing anything, okay. You're gonna restrict your energy, don't do anything, okay? just restrict the contact basically. You protect your own energy. Treasure Island, what I told you, you got a lot of opportunities. Last time you got the soulmate card, see, the intuitive, I swear, this card connects with you guys, I feel. Mm, am I playing favorites? I play favorites with all Zodiac, I am all Zodiac, right? Mm -hmm. So tell Aries why they don't watch me. Mm -hmm. And you're uh, Aries Ascendant, huh? Tur Treasure Island. Um, good things are coming. This is Saturnian. Turtle. Saturn is turtle. It takes a while, but it gets there. Always, yes. And they can live for hundreds of years. Um, there's love. There's gold. It's a treasure island. Okay, Number nine. So that's very positive. So something... I told you, it's like you're getting to this fortune, but you have to restrict. I mean, who opens up their treasure chest over there? Allowing everybody to see. Okay, so be careful with evil eye, with people being jealous. People would always get jealous if you're getting to that um, treasure. Okay, so more chances of thief. Okay, or people taking advantage of you. Okay, as you gain more successful, as you get to the treasure, be careful. Okay, let's see here. Ooh, I'm using also a different tarot. I was looking for a tarot. Okay. And then, so go on. Find this one. So let's see what's this card telling us. Okay. I feel like there's a trip that you're going because I'm hearing Bon Voyage. So there is something. Alex. I don't know who's Alex. Uh, maybe. I, I feel like Alex is a, uh, it's not a gender specific, so it can be anybody who's Alex. Okay. Because I can't read the bro or the, or the, you know, whatever. Uh-huh. So Alex, I'm feeling here. And Vini. Vini? Really? What kind of name is that? <laughs> no, sorry. Hi. <laughs> so I've been watching you three years now. Hi, Vini. <laughs> oh, how are you? Okay. Someone here is having, I don't know. I, there's two things here. Either you're having lunch or you're having intimate connection and you're still watching me. That's crazy. For you to be watching me during lunch. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> We're dropping bombs to the Scorpio. Okay, here we go. Justice card, Libra. Mars is still in Libra. Okay. So let me see what's going on here. 
Um, I feel here like you're going to make a call with regards to this person, how you're going to make the decision. Um, you know how Lady Liberty has a blindfold, you know, um, so that when you make the decision, it's like, you know, it's not looking for anybody, something like that. So you're trying to get to the situation. It's like, if I want to do this, uh, I, I want to do it the right way without even bias to yourself or to the person. Again, these are for evolved Scorpios because we can be very vindictive if we want to. So the evolution of a Scorpio is one, it's going to be for harmony. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you, because this is Venus, this is being diplomatic. Okay, making things right, making things work. Okay, let's see, maybe the justice card can be, this can also be like adjust, addressing the truth here. The veil, you know, the curtain, you know, um, that's that's the karma. Okay, two of ones, a decision, ooh, and a page of fraud. So, okay. Red is color, of, that's Martian, so taking a step forward, okay. Um, I feel like, um, I believe green is Mercury. So this is going to be a decision that you're going to make a move on because you're the Mars energy with regards to something karmic. Okay, not the whole, oh, they're with their karmic. Okay, stop with that crap. Because if they're with their karmic, it's bad. No, it's not like that. Okay, they're with that person because they're learning also that lesson. You understand me? Uh, some people, it's like, they just want to uplift their own, you know, lift their own chair with something because they didn't get picked. They didn't pick you, you're not yet the karma of the person. Here, you're showing like you're choosing who to be with in karmic, karmically. Um, page of Rods with the Two of Wands here. Can be with the younger fire sign. Mm -hmm. It's young. Those feathers over there reflects like, you know, it's like this person. I feel like, you know, it's like, you know, the air energy. This is messenger. Okay, the page is communication. So there's two people here talking. One will be the receiver of the energy. The one who's waiting with the tough ones, they're going to get that message. You're going to make that. I feel like you are the one who's going to message. Either how, how to make things work, Scorpio. I feel like you're trying to make things work. Okay, let me face here. Okay. Because it's going to get me very suffocated. Mm. Let's see here. Because someone is waiting for you here. A page of Pentacles. Someone is waiting so that they can say their apology to you. How much they appreciate you and how much they have this coin to give you. Someone wants to offer you commitment here. The coin is something serious. Um, you could be connecting with someone who's Asian descent. Okay, Asia is pretty big. Okay, so let's not focus to the, to my people. Okay, <laughs> there's a lot of Asians. Okay. <laughs> Page of Pentacles here. Let me see. Knight of Cups. But I feel like you, you have already offered this cup to this person. And you basically just opening up to them, but you already have mentioned that you have feelings for them. You're never shy of expressing. Okay. This person is younger, so chances are they were not ready. Vibration-wise also. The night shows here that you were really in quest, like you were really, really looking for love. And Knight of Swords, you're gonna make that move. I feel like you're just gonna, you're just gonna snap out and like really ex express to this person, like I told you already, I have feelings for you, okay? Because there's a volcano there. Mm -hmm. So I feel like there's urgency. Someone here could also be um, settling in divorce with Knight of Swords with a Justice card. Like, you woke up and you felt like, you know what, I'm divorcing my partner here for some, okay? Because the Knight is moving away, I feel. Two of Pentacles, you're not sure if this is the right thing to do, to open up to someone. But if you're not sure and yet you will do it though. So you're using your intuition. Because the scale is your intuition, the swords is the truth with the justice card. Not sure, and yet you're going to do it. So you're just going to trust your instinct. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. This person loves you more than you love them. Isn't that refreshing? Because this is this going that way. Because the night is you, I feel. Either you already have changed your feelings to this person and you're just going to tell them, it's like, I love you once, but not anymore, and you're moving on with your life. You as a water sign. This person never stopped loving you, if you're wondering, with the Queen of Cups. This person never did. 
there's any kind of question. Consider an energy. See, they never stop loving you, and you get a ton of cups. Mm. Page of Pentacles, their apology comes with the energy of, I'm sorry, I want to be with you, I love you, I love you a lot, you know, it's like I care about you. You know, it's like this person is dreaming constantly about you also. Mm -hmm. Page of Pentacles, your Ten of Cups. They only have one person that they're looking at, it's you. You're not looking at them anymore. Because you did the Knight of Cups and the Knight of Swords. For you, it was like you were giving them closure, something like that. You're on your way to your treasure, just to opportunity. Strength card. Remember how you always ask, where is that Leo? There is your Leo. Hmm. You've fallen out of love of the Leo. You're just obsessed, not in love. Big difference. Wanting to have something that you don't have. But later on, once you have this, you won't love this person anymore. You will say, it's like, no, I will, no, I will. Give it time. Because you will realize that this, it's a struggle to be with this person. Give it time. One year, two years. You'll try to, to ask yourself, like, why did I even put myself to this situation? Oh, right, because I love you. No. You love them before, then you're obsessed because of the power control, the power struggle. You're not satisfied until you have tamed the beast, until you have tamed this person, regardless they're Leo or not. There's a Cancerian who's all about you. It can be a Cancer Leo. It's going to be toxic a little bit if there's a Shlesha Nakshatra. Because if you're Jishta, it's a Scorpio, okay? And you have a Shlesha, both of you are a powerful individual. Both are controlling. Let's keep going for the Scorpios. Since now you found your Leo that you have been wondering... King of Cups, mm. that's you, you gotta love. Four of Swords, you've healed from a situation, that's why you're moving on. For others, you don't give an F about the, the Leo also, you moved away. There's a younger Earth sign, can be a Tyrrhenian, who loves you a lot. Knight of Pentacles here, see the Tyrrhenian came. Mm. The Cancerian and the Tyrrhenian loves you a lot. Judgment, the Leo wants to commit with you. Are you ready to be controlled? Because they're a fixed sign too. Just saying. There's someone coming back trying to claim victory. You got what you want. <clears throat> Just be careful. The Emperor. Are you ready to be controlled? Like what I mentioned. Are you ready? Because you tame the beast. But the beast that you're taming, because that's the Empress right there. At some point, they will be the one leading you. You'll be the one following. Yes, yes, yes. There's an Emperor and Empress there. That's the beast. Either you become, you guys become team players between each other, okay, and you guys will work out whatever differences, because that's the beast that's reflective of the beast, and both of you will have this happy reconciliation if it's from the past. They're ready to control you. Are you going to submit? That's the question. Because you want equal, Justice card. You don't want the whole, it's just like one-sided. That's why the first card is strongest. You have to be diplomatic with this. Don't let love, okay, be just the only focus. Love is not enough. After you guys have expressed each other how many emojis, okay, how many I love you, I care about you, that doesn't get through far, not at all. It may get through, you know, hard times, yes, but it doesn't go far. Mm -hmm. Because if this person is there to control you, you'll be so surprised, okay, you'll be so surprised. Now, the... Cancerian here or the Tyrrhenian, they choose you. They're coming after you also. With the King of Cups, you appear to be lashing out on people at the same time. I feel like you're telling people to move out, move out of your way because you're on your way to something great. And this one, not this one, you're not going to stop until you get this. Your coins and your love. So unstoppable, basically. Choose wisely with the Justice card. Make use of your um, Judgment card also. Um, your own Judgment pretty good. Okay. What else? Oh, by the way, those are your options. Just saying, Scarpia. Yeah. You got options. Okay. So link down there. And if you're a cross-watcher, of course, just vice versa. If you can be, oh my god, uh, there's always people wanting the Scorpio. They're in the 8th house. Okay. That's how it is. So, link down there in the description box for the extended. 
Thank you very much, Scorpio, for watching. Let's see as how these people, you know, come up to surface, wanting to be with you, but trying to control you. I'll see you guys again. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye.